boys and girls, I'm Ms Johnston. I'm the Senior Early Years Practitioner at Hazelhead Nursery. We look forward to welcoming you all soon with your families to explore our lovely nursery. I'm excited to meet you all. Take care. See you all soon. Bye. Hello boys and girls and mums and dads. My name is Miss Lawrence and I'm an Early Years Practitioner at Hazelhead Nursery. I'm really excited to meet you all and I hope you're looking forward to coming to join our nursery. We have lots and lots of fun. Okay, see you soon. Bye! Hi boys and girls, I am Miss Henderson and I am one of the early years practitioners at Hazelhead Nursery who will be looking after you very soon. I hope you're all excited and ready to come and have some fun with us. I can't wait to meet you. See you soon. Bye. Hello boys and girls. My name is Mrs Charles. I'm an early years practitioner and I work in the nursery on a Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. I'm really looking forward to meeting you all and getting to know you. The things that I love doing in the nursery are reading stories and doing arts and crafts and play -Doh. I wonder what you're going to enjoy doing when you come. Looking forward to seeing you all soon. Bye. Hello boys and girls, my name is Mrs Newlands and I'm an early years practitioner at Hazelhead Nursery. You'll usually see me in nursery on a Wednesday afternoon, Thursday and Friday. I'm really looking forward to meeting you all. Stay safe. Bye. Hi boys and girls, my name is Mrs Morrison. When I'm in the nursery, one of my most favourite things to do is to be in the story corner and reading stories. I just love finding out what happens in the books and sharing the stories with you. I really can't wait to see you. Bye! We know that hand washing is really, really important to do. So at nursery, when you first arrive, you must go and wash your hands before you start to play. And then the other times that we need to wash our hands is once we've been to the toilet, before we have our snack, and if they get messy when we're playing with the paint or outside in the garden. When you come to nursery, we will visit the gym hall. Here we have opportunities to run, hop, skip, jump, crawl, climb, balance, ball skills such as throwing and catching and kicking. We can use lots of equipment here too, like mats, bats, balls, cones, bean bags, hula hoops, benches, climbing apparatus, ladders, coloured shape mats. We also play lots of circle games here too and many other games and we can use a parachute. We can also make up obstacle courses for you to try and have lots of fun with. Great for gross motor skills, balance, coordination, spatial awareness and developing muscles and movement. Our nursery garden at Hazelhead Nursery is free flow, so you can choose when you want to go outside. The door is always open. Here you will find many areas such as our creative area, water wall, sand pit, planting area, musical instruments, mud kitchen, small world, woodwork. We've even got a cosy Wendy house with books and dress up and cosy cushions. Many loose parts such as tires, crates, guttering, wood planks and cones for open-ended learning. We have bikes and scooters and you can even take your own to nursery. We have ramps and a track to go round to practice your balance and steering. We also have our snack outside too. The Messy Garden is our fabulous learning outdoor nature area where you can explore and investigate the outdoors while being safe and active and have many fun adventures here. Super for health and well-being, spatial awareness, gross motor skills, creativity, numeracy and literacy opportunities here too, movement and sensory, social and personal development, lots of risky play here too and an overall sense of health and happiness, resilience and independence here. We have trees, muddy puddles, 
mud kitchen, spades, wheelbarrow, trowels, pots and pans, magnifying glasses, binoculars, cameras, many loose parts for many open-ended play experiences here, like making dens, scavenger hunt stories, explorer wildlife and mini beasts, science experiments. We can have fires here too, while staying safe. And we need litter helpers some days too. We can have our healthy snack here where the children all wash our hands and they help to hand out the foods to everyone. At Hazelhead School we have a lovely library which the nursery children get to use. They'll be given a library folder and taken to the library by a member of staff who will read them a story and then they'll get to choose a book to take home. You must remember to take that book back the next week, boys and girls, so you can choose another book. Games and puzzles. We have lots of games and puzzles at Hazelhead Nursery and they're great for fine motor skills, sharing, taking turns, problem solving, counting and lots more other skills. At the writing area, you will be able to mark make using a variety of different things, including pens, pencils and crayons. We have alphabet stamps that help you to learn your alphabet. We have stencils and lots more. You'll be able to draw a picture for mummy and daddy or maybe one to put up in the classroom. In our home corner you will find table, chairs, sofa, plates, cups, cutlery, kitchen utensils, pots and pans, washing machine, fridge, cooker, real food such as fruit and vegetables, tinned food, dressing up clothes, baby dolls, baby dolls clothes, prams, bottles, nappies, scales, clock, calendar and a cookbook. What you will get in this area is you will interact with other children, practice your language and social skills, use imagination, act out and learn about different family roles, fine and gross motor development, have an understanding of numbers, dress yourself, play cooperatively, share and take turns, reenact an event. In our sand area you will find buckets, spades, rakes, number and letter pebbles, jewels, containers, diggers, moulds, funnels, measuring cups, natural materials such as sticks, pebbles, pine cones and shells. What you will do in this area is develop your fine and gross motor skills use of mathematical language, have an understanding of volume and capacity, problem solve, language and vocabulary, playing alongside peers, playing independently, share, turn take and creativity. We have a play do area which you can make your own play do if you wish with help from an adult. In this area there's lots of resources for you to use to make and design anything you wish with the Play-Doh. We have got natural resources like stones and pine cones and sticks and shells. There's also small things like buttons and sequins and googly eyes and sequins to help to decorate your creations. There's also a cooker. Some of the children like to pretend to make cakes and sausages and pizza. nursery you can use the computers to play some games. You could play counting games, pattern games, shape games or some games with your friends. You can also use the computers to learn how to type things like your name and you can also use them to find out more about some things. It might be that you want to know more about dinosaurs or about volcanoes or maybe it's even something that you found in the garden that you'd like to know more about. area you can be as creative and as messy as you like. There's a variety of tools that you can use for painting with. There's paint brushes and rollers and toothbrushes and sponges 
and you can even use your hands and your fingers. There is a painting easel where you can mix up the paints and make lots of different colours. We have a variety of collage materials to make pictures with like buttons and sequins and pipe cleaners and tissue paper and many more. You can also make junk models out of big boxes, toilet roll holders, egg cartons, we've got tape and glue. So lots of fun to be had in this area. In our small world area, you will find dinosaurs, mini beasts, toy space rockets with astronauts, story basket, role play equipment such as people who help us, non-fiction and fiction books. What you will do in this area is express your thoughts and feelings, use imaginative skills, play independently or alongside other children, build on your language school skills, reenact a story, learn about dinosaurs, learn about mini beasts, learn the role of a person who helps us. One of our most popular areas of our nursery is our woodwork area. In this area you get to use tools such as hammers, nails, screwdrivers and even a saw to build models. You can add buttons, beads, corks and pieces of material to build anything you want. Could be towers, cars, boats, trains, castles, people. Before you use this area, we show you how to use the tools safely so that you can keep yourself and your friends safe when using this area. Hi, I'm going to tell you a little bit about the music area that we have. Not only in the music area will you find some instruments, but you'll also find a little stage. And you can go there and you can sing, you can dance, you can make music. It's completely up to you what you can put your musical minds to. In the construction area, we have a wide variety of resources for you to play with. We have large wooden blocks, we have got small wooden blocks, we've got a train set, we've got Lego and we've got Duplo. We also have a wide variety of natural resources like stones and shells and pine cones and sticks. We have got small figures and animal figures. We have vehicles and large wooden vehicles. You can also dress up. We've got hard hats and high vis vests. We've got clipboards and writing materials so you can put down your ideas on paper if you wish. In this area you can create anything that you like. The children make buses and cars and towers and palaces and zoos and ramps, anything you can make. In the water tray, the children are provided with lots of resources to encourage their curiosity and imagination. Equipment for pouring, measuring, stirring, mixing and lots more. Whilst in the water tray, the children are asked to wear an apron and push their sleeves up so they don't get too wet. In the cloakroom area of our nursery we have a dark den. This is a dark tent that has lots of different lights in it. We've got a bubble tube, we've got fibre optic lights, we have some torches, some fairy lights and some squeezy star lights. This is a quiet space where you can come and spend time with a small group of friends. At the snack area, this is where you'll enjoy a healthy snack with your friends every day. There will be a selection of fresh fruit and vegetables and maybe something like a pancake or a bagel to choose from. Each day, we choose two boys and girls to help prepare a snack for their friends, so you'll get a chance to do that too. And on a Thursday, we do some baking, so you will all get a chance to do some baking as well for snack the next day.